My name's Sam Rose, I'm from North Wales, and I'm a computer science student at Glamorgan. The reason I chose computer science is mainly because I did IT at A-level, and it wasn't really quite enough, and I wanted to do more. I came to an open day, or applicant day, I think it's called, and all of the staff here were really cool, uh, everyone was really nice, all the computer labs looked like sweet shops to me, so... Um, but it was all done through the UCAS process, most of my research. I'd try and find university websites and see what I had to offer, really. Typical days start in the afternoon, normally, <laughs> as most computing students will probably tell you. Uh, lots of late nights staying up programming, but usually I'll, I'll wake up um, and I go to university before I do anything else. Then when I come home from university, after I've done lectures and occasionally like teaching and extracurricular stuff, I will... Um, <laughs> relax for a little bit after I've come back from university, then I'll work on some of the projects that I work on. Um, I've got about two or three going at the moment. The staff at the university are very useful, um, very helpful, very nice people. Um, not only in like lab sessions and lectures, but also outside of lab sessions and lectures. Sort of, like, it's different school, because at school it's Mr Lewis and stuff like that, but they don't like that university. It's usually first names, it's a lot more personal. And I liked that change quite a lot, because I like to feel that I'm kind of an equal and treated as an adult now, so that's a good thing about university. Tutorial sessions usually are based on the previous lecture. Uh, you go into one of the computer labs, log into a computer and there's some sort of exercise on Blackboard or something. Um, for example, one of my modules called Rich Internet Applications, we're doing PHP, which is a web programming language and a lot of the tutorials have been connecting to databases and stuff using the university's web server because students get web space and access to databases and things and you connect via MySQL and PHP um, and lecturers get involved if you have problems they usually walk around ask if everything's okay if you need any help if you don't understand anything uh, it's very kind of free form you can come and go as you please um, you can go and see the lecturers after the tutorial if you want to, if you've got any extra problems that you didn't ask during the tutorial. I don't drink, so that excludes lots of typical student activities, but I play on a local pool team. Uh, there's a Kiss Shop pool club, which is literally a minute outside university. And every Thursday we have league matches and stuff, and it's it's quite social. You like you can have a few drinks if you want to, and everyone plays some, some pool, and it's just a good atmosphere, really. And that's what I do with most of my social life. Other than that, a uh, typical computing student, like gaming with friends and things. Ooh, the best three things about computing at Glamorgan. Um, last year, the forensics lab was pretty cool. Uh, like disk imaging, looking for hidden files, encrypted disks, and that kind of thing. That was all very sort of super cool hacker stuff. Um, the computer labs in general, really. I mean, you, you walk in, you have this seven megabytes a second download speed. Um, everything's super quick and you've got all the software that you need um, and I suppose the lecturers uh, would have to come in my top three as well because they all seem to know their stuff and you can have a really good conversation um, about whatever you're deciding to do. Uh, in my first year I wanted to program some more than I was already doing with the lectures and things and I spoke to Andrew Scott and he challenged me to write a chess game and he like he said it'll take you a couple of months. You need to do this. You need to do that. And like three days later, I'd done it. <laughs> he, yeah, he was quite surprised, and he set in more challenges to learn more things and sort of pushed me to improve, which really did help me in improving. <laughs>